Hello, I'm Liz Hicks with ClearSnap. Today I'm going to show you the versatility of using our smooch spritz and creating it into a watercolor effect for your crafting projects. What I'm going to start is I have a nice, beautiful, just black and white stamped image here, and I want to go ahead and color it in with the smooch spritz. I have a paint palette. And I'm just going to add little bits of my ink. And since the smooch spritz is a spray ink, you will get a really nice, beautiful, vivid color, even if you are diluting it. It does turn into somewhat of a watercolor, but with traditional watercolors, what happens is that when you dilute it, it becomes really kind of dull and drab. What I love about the smooch spritz is that they still have a lot of pigment content to where if you do dilute it, you're not losing too much of that intensity, you're just getting a softer color. What we can do now is take our smooch spritz and then just add a little bit of water. And again, this doesn't take away from the intensity of the pigment. It just allows it to move a little bit more like water and still become, give that watercolor kind of effect. Okay. Start with our lighter colors. And what I want to do is just go ahead and blend. Now I'm going to go ahead and take a darker color and just feather it in so that it creates that really nice, beautiful watercolored effect. And you can always you know, flip, use a different brush, clean your brush off in between, adding a little bit more of the yellow. And then lastly, I'm going to go ahead and go in with the purple. going to clean off my brush real quick. And lastly, I'm going to go ahead and go in with the purple and just top this off and give it that beautiful, beautiful richness of color. And like I said, you can always go back in, adding a little bit more color. But what you'll see is that the smooch spritz does act very much like a watercolor when you add a little water to it. it. Gives it that really nice blendable quality, but it does give you that beautiful watercolored effect that you can just kind of mix the colors together and as your leisure, just kind of create that beautiful watercolored style of card, scrapbook project, or mixed media piece, home decor, on any sort of project, this beautiful technique would definitely work for you.